Hey, how's it going? I just wanted to give a quick update on the uh, AstroTech 13 millimeter 100 degree field of view eyepiece uh, after I got to field test it pretty extensively. You know, I looked at a number of objects in it and there, it was really great. It, you know, this thing framed the full moon in the eyepiece, 13 millimeters, pretty crazy. You kind of had to like roll your head around a little bit to see the, the whole moon, but it was all there. Yeah, it was like 98% illuminated. <clears throat> so it was pretty much a full moon. And uh, yeah, that's the thing. You kind of have to move your eyeball and like rotate around if you want to see the field stop in it. But I mean, it's great. There's no eye placement issues whatsoever. Um, I'll have the I'll have the eye cup folded up, you know, because I don't wear glasses. But I mean, it's it's great. I would recommend it. This thing is on sale um, right now from Astronomics. Yeah, I don't have anything bad to say, but I love I love the bottom. It unscrews, so this so like it's a two inch eyepiece right now, you know, but then you can unscrew this, and it becomes a one and a quarter inch eyepiece. I used it as both, and this is threaded under here for filters, and uh, this is threaded too. I actually I actually put a uh, one and a quarter inch Vader Moon and Glot Sky Glow filter in here. I put it in there. And then I think I, um, I used it. I must have used it. I must have put this back on is what I did. I screwed it on and I used it as a two inch eyepiece with that one and a quarter um, filter on. And it was great and everything. But whenever I took it off, the filter was like stuck. The filter was like stuck in this piece. And so I had to, I had to get that out. I think I had to put it back on tighten it and then like unscrew it so that was kind of that was kind of weird i was like man but my filter was stuck in this piece but i mean it's probably just more practice or just understand how it works would be good but this is an excellent eyepiece it's the exact same as the apms they're made in the same factory from what i heard it's great i, I really don't have any complaints about it it's an awesome eyepiece and, and using this thing with a coma corrector it's like it's like a freaking grenade it's huge See, here's my GSO coma corrector. You put this thing in there, man, and it's like, it's crazy big. So this is how big this thing is, man. It just feels, it's just nuts. There you go, it's all the way now. So, yeah, you pretty much have to use a coma corrector with this thing because, you know, stars will get elongated at the edge of the field. That's it. It's a great eyepiece. It's probably, yeah, it's my first 100 degree eyepiece. So uh, I, I would definitely recommend it. If you see this, I mean, it's on sale right now for, I think, 250 bucks. It's going to go up to 300. The APMs are 300. But I love it. Thanks.